you guys welcome back I hope you guys are having the best day ever as always before I get started guys if you are new here please subscribe if you haven't already done that we're on the road to 67,000 subscribers and I would love you to join me on this journey so hit subscribe right now and join the fam and also guys go follow me on all my social media links are in the description I have Facebook Twitter Instagram and even snapchat so you can follow me on all of those and once again I am coming back at you guys with another creepy video and today we're officially on episode 47 of paranormal America traveling the 50 states of the United States heading west to east and looking at all the creepy stuff that's happening each day along the way which currently brings us to New Hampshire but before we get started on that guys we have to jump right over to say it with me guys paranormal America to paranormal america and today we are talking about the old country tavern which is located in nashua new hampshire so the story goes back in 1741 that was like more than 10 years ago guys 1741 captain ford a seaman of the english extraction he built what is now known as the Country Tavern as a home for him and his 22-year-old wife. Captain Ford was an older man, and apparently from the start, they had nothing but problems with their relationship. Now, the captain was always at sea. He was always going out to sea, and sometimes he wouldn't come home for like a year. So he was always away from his wife. But on this particular occasion, Captain Ford returns home after 10 months at sea to find out his wife has given birth to a baby. Almost immediately, the captain flew into a huge fit of homicidal rage. He locked his wife Elizabeth up in a closet for two whole days. When he finally released her, he told her that he had killed and buried the baby, but he wouldn't tell her where. Elizabeth then became so raged at what he had just told her that she attacked her deranged husband. While they were both fighting, he grabs a knife and stabs her to death, and then he finally disposes of her body down the well behind the house. Now, what became of the captain is not really known, but it is said that Elizabeth's ghost is still at this country tavern, which is now a restaurant, so you can go and visit. But there has been a lot of reports of Elizabeth's ghosts wandering around this place in search of her baby's Body. But like I said, guys, in the 1980s, this place was converted into a restaurant now, so you can go there, and it's actually apparently really nice, but they are very open about it being haunted. They will talk to you, they will let you interview them, um, and they even host uh, ghost, hun ghost hunts, ghost, what are they called? Ghost hunts, like paranormal investigations there which is pretty cool. Now, guests who have been to this place have reported seeing things like the salt and pepper shakers moving across the table, cups of coffee going off the table, dishes going off the table. And even though she's described as being very mischievous, she's never actually harmed anybody. There's also been a lot of reports of people seeing her gazing out of the barn window where her baby was apparently buried. Now, staff working at this place have also experienced things such as a full body shadow actually pressing against them or brushing past them, which is really terrifying. This has been going on for so many years, so the people who have worked there, they actually feel like they've, they've got to know Elizabeth, like she's no harm to them, she's never threatened anybody, but she is apparently a little bit of a prankster. And also guys, if you do go there, apparently the well is still there, but it is now it's covered up like a manhole. It's uh, mostly filled in, um, but it it is covered up, but it's still there. So you can actually see the well which Elizabeth's body was dumped down, which is really creepy. Now, my question to all of you for question of the day is, would you like to go visit this place? Let me know in the comment section. That is question of the day. Magic 8-Ball. Is Elizabeth's spirit at the Country Tavern in Nashua, New Hampshire? I was in Massachusetts. Is she really still there? It is decidedly so. And also, you guys know, I've started this thing called Random Fact of the Day, where I like to poison your heads with powerful knowledge so that y'all don't have to go to school anymore. And today's Random Fact of the Day is... Did you know that Tyrannophobia is actually the fear of being tickled by feathers? Now, I hate being tickled, but being tickled by a feather, I actually 
kind of enjoy that. Like, it's not too overpowering. It's just nice so that you can feel it. I don't know. I'm a very ticklish person, but I do, I, I do get very violent <laughs> when somebody's tickling me. Um, especially when people do that rib cage thing or the bottom of your feet. Hell nah. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button down below and let's see if we can go for 500,000 billion likes on this video. I would really appreciate that. And remember the most important thing of all, chase your dreams, guys. I love you all. Hell nah.